Hi friends, Christine here, your city librarian at the Moore Park City Library. And today is Monday, May 4th, 2020, also known as Star Wars Day. So we're celebrating at the library by bringing you two fun treats that you can make to celebrate at home. Uh, they're really simple using ingredients and supplies that you already have or that you can get really easily. Um, so the first one's gonna be a lightsaber fruit skewer. And then the next video we'll have today will be by Miss Carol, and she's going to make Yoda Soda, a nice, cool, sweet treat. So let's go ahead and get started with our fruit skewers. The first thing that you're going to need is some cut up fruit. So I've already gone and pre-cut my strawberries, kiwi. Um, I had some canned pineapple and blueberries, really any fruit that you want to use. Although traditionally lightsabers, the dark side you'll find them in red, and then the light side you'll find in green and blue. Although you can really do whatever you want. This is your lightsaber. Uh, you're going to need skewers. Uh, you can use chopsticks. At the library, we have a ton of chopsticks because we use them to make wands for Harry Potter. Uh, the thing about a chopstick is it is a little bit thicker than a skewer, so it might be harder for you to put the fruit on and then keep the fruit there. Uh, the other thing I found, I don't know why we had these, but we had um, s'mores skewers for camping. And so I was able to do my longer lightsabers by just cutting one of these in half. And skewers are great because they start with a point, and so it's a lot easier to put your fruit on. Um, for the base of your lightsaber, your handle, you're going to need just a little bit of aluminum foil. And you can use a black Sharpie, although you will need to give it time to dry. Uh, but I decided, because I can't wait for it to dry, to use just a little bit of duct tape. We have a ton of duct tape because it's really popular with our teens. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm gonna use my chopstick to do my skewer. And the first thing you want to do is take your aluminum foil and you actually don't even need this long of a piece. We can actually cut this even smaller. Oops. And you're just going to wrap that around the base of your skewer. Don't worry about it being perfect. It can get, it can look crumbly. There we go. All right. So we've got that on our base. Next, you're gonna to wanna to take your black duct tape or, and you can see we're getting to the end of the roll, but that's okay because we just need a little bit to create those black bands. And this is where you can have fun with it. Just freehand it. Um, I'm gonna do some thin black strips. I'm going to put one at the top. This also helps to hold your aluminum foil in place. Um, otherwise, you could, if you're using a Sharpie, just use a little bit of scotch tape um, to help hold it. Otherwise, it will slide down. Okay, we're going to do another thin one, and we'll put this towards the bottom. And then I'm going to do a little bit thicker one in the middle. Okay, so there we go. We have the handle of our lightsaber. Uh, the next thing we're going to need to do is actually put our fruit on there. Um, like I said, if you want to do all one color, you can, um, you know, just stick to one fruit. So we've got our strawberry for red, we've got blueberries for blue, kiwi for green, and I had pineapples, and I love pineapples, so I went ahead and made a yellow one. Um, like I said, have fun with it. I also thought that if you didn't want to stick to just one color and you wanted to mix it up and put all sorts of different fruit on here, you could call it an Obi-Wan Kababi. Uh, but we're doing uh, lightsabers today, so I'm gonna go ahead and stick with one color and I'm gonna go ahead and put my strawberry on. Now my strawberry's cut 
really thin. I would really suggest cutting it a little bit thicker, but I, I tend to cut it thinner because I have a, a little, little one at home. Um, let's see, let's put it on the fatter side. There we go. Oops. So we're just gonna put those on. Let's see if I can get this one. Okay. And there you have it. Um, and I unconsciously chose red. So <laughs> I don't know what that means about me choosing the dark side. Anyways, there you have it. A super simple fruit skewer uh, lightsaber that you can make to celebrate Star Wars Day today. Um, makes an excellent addition to your lunch and your blue milk, or better yet, Miss Carol's Yoda soda that she's going to show you in our very next videos. So may the fourth be with you.